Say not to troll. Um, so my so my fundamental position is this. Why I come to the park is to shine a spotlight on anti-Semitism. And anti-Semitism can come from white supremacists, far right. It can come from Hebrew Israelites. It can what come about from, Islam? It can come. I agree, and I should shine, shine a spotlight on that as well. I agree. Um, but my focus is because I'm a Jew. I'm focusing on. Of course, I'm, yeah, yeah. equally, me as a Muslim, I'm focused on Islamophobia, yeah. and your actions might fall under Islamophobia. Your statements, and so, so, so. but I have to give you back. You just yeah. mentioned a moment ago that. You want to change your, your interaction with Muslims, is that so, so, right? So, so let, me, let me be really clear. So in what? shining a spotlight on anti-Semitism coming from the Muslim community... Ignorant, that just, it, yeah, so ignorant it, 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 individuals just, uh, who are not familiar allow me with to speak and then respond to me. Emotional. Allow, allow me to speak and then respond. Oh, sorry. That wasn't mine, that was someone else's. No, no, no I'm, going. Um, I'm going. I'm going. In, in shining a spotlight. One minute. Yes. In shining a spotlight on that is uh, that anti-Semitism. What? Sorry. Uh, yeah. On that anti-Semitism, what it has done, it's presenting only a negative view of Islam, and that's not my position. Which is why I've reached out to several of my Muslim friends, who I'm good friends with, scholars, and asked, "Will you come on my channel, and we can show positive things where it was good for Jews living under Islam?" commonalities within the faith like for instance we would go and hug to Jerusalem and circle the the temple the Beit HaMikdash seven times and in the Muslims same way you go to Hajj do, and Muslims do not do you any Hajj. religious rituals from other faiths so this I'm not is saying, not part I'm, of I'm, our I'm religion showing, yeah, I'm, I'm not showing point. you the, the I'm Dawood. just highlighting. I'm for saying you to Dawood, know. Dawood did something very similar to what in Jerusalem to what Muslims did what, in the Kaaba today. Yeah. It's right. We don't need to get sidetracked. What I'm doing is I'm saying that what I wanted to do is shine a spotlight on some of the positives because if all people see on my channel is negatives, they'll have a negative impression of Islam, and that's not my intention. Look, you know what is best? Just go openly and and uh, say you were wrong to, to do such and such. Yeah, well, where was I wrong? If I'm wrong, I'm wrong. So, but, okay, but. that's the point then. You don't believe that we can be friends, we can be normal. I think so. if someone refuses to, I would say if someone ourselves. refuses to say peace be upon you. It is permissible I, by the I, way, but there are differences of opinion amongst the Muslim scholars and people might react in accordance to that which is visible from you, you're trying to trigger them or you're trying to play games. So, so equally I would re react negatively if I sense that you're not being honest. Yes. But so, and that's why I told him, do not. What's, so, what are you trying to promote so what, on your page? What, what I'm saying, what I'm saying or is, channel. for any Muslim that interprets it, and when I sincerely go up to them and genuinely, and this is complete genuine, I wish assalamu alaikum, and it's genuine I'm wishing peace upon them. Um, if they, There's nothing wrong to reply wa alaikum salam so, so, from an Islamic point of view. And so but from, for me, that, there are differences of opinion. I, I understand this difference. I, I understand this, those differences. And so why from, would from you attack a Muslim who decides to follow the view that is not permissible because, to give to a non-Muslim? Because from a Jewish perspective, from a non-Muslim perspective, if there is if there is an opinion that you can wish peace be upon them, and you're refusing to, and you're going with the tradition that says and upon you. Then for me, that's the extreme position, and that's why it's why is it extreme. Why? Why would I that be? I know it's my standards. That, yeah. extreme, when someone makes a judgment of extreme, yeah. that is a subjective standard that Look, they're setting. Why is you something? Please, Sorry. please. You, you have say. you prayed in a mosque before? Um, I've been to a masjid. I've never no, prayed in a masjid. Prayed? Never. Would ever. you pray in a masjid? I would. Yes. Why? Why haven't you? Uh, why haven't I? Because I think many people would object to me praying um, Jewish prayers. In a, in a masjid, but if that was okay and that was fully accepted by the, 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 the community, I would have no issue doing that yet. Okay, so from an Islamic standpoint, it's okay for Jews to pray in a mosque? Um, yeah, from a Jewish or Islamic? From an Islamic perspective. Uh, from a Jewish perspective. From, from a Jewish from, standard, it's I'm also gonna, okay. I'm just going to ask this question. From a Jewish standard, from, from it's also a, okay. From a Jew, Jewish uh, perspective, it's okay for a Jew to pray in a mosque? Yeah, but, but as long as they're saying Jewish prayers and they're not mentioning Muhammad. When I say yeah. a Jew pray in a mosque, a Jew praying Jewish prayers, yeah, yeah. obviously. Now, Jews, because it, Jews you, using Islam. using using your analogy, using your analogy, because you're allowed. Listen to this, brother. Using your analogy, because you've been into a mosque, alhamdulillah, yeah. but you've not prayed Jewish prayers in a mosque. You've chosen not to do so. I can say, ah, now you're extremist. So, so the, the, the reason I've done that is can for I not? respect for yeah, the community. Can I not? It's for respect for the community. So equally, can I not? For the yeah. respect equally, for the exactly. Where we, look, if you were in, under threat, would, do you think you would just stand with here, with us bunch of Muslims? No. I, I mean, I've been violently threat. assaulted here many times. Yeah, but these yeah. are uh, but I don't feel threatened by either of you. No, listen, yeah, yeah. if I was present, 
I myself would be the first exactly. to stop them because exactly. this is incorrect. If you watch any of my videos where I've been attacked, what I always say is I've yeah. been attacked by someone from Algeria, wherever it may be, but it was always Muslims that came to my defense, and I've said that every single yeah, time. So you have to be fair. And, I, and, I try to be fair, that's yes, what I'm yes. saying. I'm trying to be straight with you. Look, this is what we want. You know, well, having, well, to have an honest discussion. No, we no, might no, disagree. As a Muslim, I'm 100% believe that Zionism is an oppression. That's as fine. a Muslim. That's fine. Okay, and we disagree. And you as a Zionist, you might believe that the Israel has the right to have a state, yes. even taken by force and oppressing I, I and killing. I disagree with all that. I don't agree we can take by force. I don't agree we can oppress. Okay, well, that's a separate debate. Yeah, so but that's the, the point. One. That's the point I'm trying to make. What's well, the point? So just so I understand what you're saying. I, I don't understand what the connection is. Now. What I'm trying to establish is that... We can agree we to might, disagree with an element of respect. Okay. It doesn't mean I have the right to come and um, op harm you, oppress you. But, but equally, you don't have the there. right to come there. and lie against Muslims and try to say that Muslims are these and Muslims are that. And therefore, the state I lied? of Israel, I lied? I've, I've watched your, your videos trying to justify that the state of Israel is, is justified because of the action of these Muslims. Would you, would you, would you agree that have been Khalafa that have oppressed Jews? Look, if a Muslim re emotionally reacts to you, and your and your provocations. It doesn't mean Islam teaches you. But that wasn't my question. My question was: Are there Khalafa that have oppressed Jews? Look, there are Muslims in prison right now. Does it mean Islam teaches them to become I, I agree criminals? With, I agree with all so of that. It's, it's the same. It's the same. So the only thing Martin. I can defend is Islam, not individuals or Muslims. Okay. So, so, I can defend so, Islam. So, 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 it's not for me to defend the of Muslims. So it's clear for you and the, the reason why I talk. The only reason I bring up things like. Jews yeah, and, and, and the Dima and, and the laws of how you how you treat the Don't we pay the, taxes? The, 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 can it, can it, please let me. The reason I bring this up is because when we've lived under different khalafa, they've implemented their policies in different ways. Yeah, now let, let's say let's say let's say that the, the the purest truest form of Islam, and there, let's say there is a truest purest form of Islam, and there's one um, matab, there's one school which has just got it right. And and please, Aki, if if there is one school which has got it right and if that's implemented then the Jews will have a good life the Christians yeah. will have a good life the Muslims yeah. will have a good life my friend let's say that I, exists look, to, but I'm not complete. dealing with that I'm dealing justice. with reality I'm justice. dealing with history justice. I'm dealing with Listen, what happened justice look if you betray uh, look during the lifetime of Prophet Muhammad peace be upon you the Jews were treated rightly as long as you don't betray the Muslims and you don't break your treaties expect the consequences that's just how things roll that's the nature of things around the world. I made 20 parts on my YouTube channel last month and I had millions of views. I'm doing it so Jews are aware of anti-Semitism and to promote relief. Okay, Joseph, I think we're done. Oh, Joseph, they're done. And you were told not to talk to me. <laughs> pray in the mosque. Invite me to the mosque, I'll pray there. Inshallah. Inshallah. We say, um, uh, believe in the It's not an oath, but inshallah it will happen. God willing. Thank you for your time.